Hi guys, welcome to online digital marketing training. In this video, I'm explaining about how to optimize your YouTube older videos. Okay, so before you watch the video, uh, watch my previous videos also, how to start a channel and how to optimize your videos, how to get 1000 subscribers and uh, how to watch the, read the analytics. Now watch this anyway. See guys, I'm, I started uploading my videos since 2017, 2017. Obviously, uh, every year I come up with the videos. The same SEO videos, Google Ads videos, SEO videos, 2017 I made, 2018, 2019, again 2020. Every year it's keep on changing so that I always come up with the new options and I'll make a new video. Okay, so what is, why it is important to optimize your older videos? Let's take an example. Uh, assume that in 2017, I made a video called uh, SEO video, SEO optimization, search engine optimization 2017. This is the video. So someone searching about that search in Optimus 2017, my video is coming on the top. But when it comes to 2018, people will not search in 2017. They'll search 2018. So my video will not perform well. So I have to change it anyway. I have to change some titles, description, many things I have to make changes so that still people will come to my older videos. Let's say this, uh, log into your channel and uh, here come back to analytics. Once you come to analytics in the dashboard, they'll show you views, watch time and subscribers in the last 28 days. So first it will be views, click on the subscribers. Then you have a subscribers list, how it is coming here. Click on see more option so that only to subscribers they'll show you some analytics and let us see those analytics. Yes, so the more detailed uh, things they give. Now let's come back here. So here they're showing information which video gave you more subscriber in the last 28 days. Google Ads advanced video tutorial this is the recently uploaded on April 10th and they got uh, 339 views and 7 subscribers. Very good. Next is Google Ads search campaign I uploaded in 2018 in December. So this got uh, 5 subscribers for me and 114 views in the last 28 days. Starting from 2019 I got very good subscribers I'll show you that also. But now it is reduced as compared to my previous years. So, so I have to optimize this video. Again, you, you have to change your thumbnails also. So let's see this video now. Let me click on this. Good thing is the thumbnail is good. So most of the time I mention the thumbnail that so Google Ads 2020. Why? Because even my SEO is not performing well. If you're coming down in the sixth or seventh place also, they will see the thumbnail. I'm, I'm highlighting with 2020. So there is a possibility they will click on that. If I could have mentioned 2019 again, I have to change the thumbnail also here. I haven't mentioned. If it is so, I could have go there. I will not change uh, that thumbnail also. But I will not change it to 2020. Why? Because this is not 2020 video. So I'm giving a wrong information to the user. So I'll mention like this only. But here I will remove this 2019. Here also I will not mention 2020. See what I'm doing here. So I'm clicking on this video. I'll get the details, more detail I'll be getting here. Yes, Google Ads search campaign for beginners 2019. 114 views, 17 hours they watch, five subscribers in the last 28 days. This is the revenue guard. So when you click on this, it will go to the video also. So this is the video actually. So total 7,000 views and very good subscribers. I got it anyway. And uh, yeah, I'll show you the total subscribers here instead of last 28 days since uploaded lifetime. I will show you lifetime. If you see 137 subscribers, I got it only with this video. You never know which video is going to be highlighted. Sometimes one of my video got 555 subscribers also. And see 94,000 times ad my web, my ad video appeared. 
but 94000 time they didn't click they might be in somewhere else maybe because of a number of reasons anyway right so this is the video i can see uh, i have to change the title and description so i'm i'm going to edit the video i'm making some changes don't bluff them this is 2090 video and don't make it as 2020 people are not blind they'll see the uploaded time also and moreover if you put it as a 2020 you will see comments like don't make us fool and all this that's not correct anyway so google ad adwords search campaign for beginners this was the title and at the time my description was not great actually uh, because this time i'm understood how to make call to action buttons and how to attract more business to title and description so it is improved do the course will improve anyway so but before i make title and description i will see here the traffic source how people are coming to my video clearly see this because my video title was 2019 see in the 2019 beginning very good views i got it it's not very good but when it's come to 2020 it is decreasing because nobody is searching with 2019 so i have to remove it. it's important now if i don't optimize it slowly this video will get vanished i won't get views of course i can do my newer videos but if you keep on doing new videos what about your older videos it also got some value right so if i say this is the traffic i got it mostly from youtube search 3000 views i got it watch time 3000 378 sorry duration and impressions right suggested videos and all these things let me go to youtube search i want to see what they have searched what is the keyword they used see my idea got succeeded people search with the ear and i mentioned that i'm succeeded mostly this is the keywords i put it in the clipboard i mentioned all those keywords now i'm planning to change it to 2020 here i'm not changing my title i'm changing the tags only so i want to appear for 2020 also okay i i took the keywords here and i come back here and change the title google adwords search campaign for beginners still i have some characters left now i'm using something like uh, what is the most keywords used google adwords tutorial for beginners google ad search campaign for beginners already there and the many keywords i'm using google ads tutorial for beginners Search ads done. Now in the description, guys, you might have observed my description. Uh, every time I use, I ask them to come to my website because my mode of making a video is to give information at the same time, bring traffic to my website also. And I'm asking them to go for my e-learning to join my online sessions also. So I'm going for there grab one video and i'll take the description there it's the common description i use yeah i came back to my another youtube channel my video and i'm copying this like if you want to access all my digital marketing videos request for e-learning so this text i'm copying and i'm pasting over here this was missing in my previous videos and at the same time recently from the past three days only I'm asking them to come to my follow me on Twitter, LinkedIn, and Instagram also. This also I'm copying now. Let's see if it's perfect or not. No, it's not copied completely. I've stored it somewhere in the notepad. Let me check this. Let me 
this. Now after that, that's 2019 I'll be moving because 2019 is gone. Nobody will search about 2019. Now this is the perfect title in description. See guys, I never bluffed about my 2020. That's not correct. But people will not see this anyway. If I put here, people will see this. But if I put it in tags, nobody will see here. Here I want to put it in. Now all the keywords I gathered, I've seen because of my video, what people are searching I gathered. I'm copying them. I'm using it as a tags here. I think all of them are not copied. Let me copy it. Yes, guys, I've copied all the tags here. This is very important. Again, you might be asking questions. So someone searching Google AdWords 2020 and issuing this video, but this is not 2020. How will you satisfy them? So what I'm going to do it is in the description because I don't want to waste my video old video but I don't want to misguide them also that's why I clearly mentioning them that guys this is my old video please follow my new video and I'm going to paste the new video code here so that uh, they always come to my new video at the same time. I'll be getting views for the both of the videos 